Welcome back. Many of us, from time to time, we take the time to enjoy a beautiful flower or a butterfly, but the Youngstown Rotary is taking it a step further. They're working with others locally and throughout the nation to ensure that bees, birds, and other flying creatures have the conditions they need in order to thrive. So here with us this morning to tell us more about Operation Pollination is Elaine Bozik. Good morning, Elaine. Good morning. Now, Elaine, tell us what is Operation Pollination all about? Oh, Operation Pollination is a collaborative Rotary project that took flight, if you will, when Rotary International in June approved a new area of focus for its foundation in support of the environment. As an SRAG project, that's Environmental Sustainability Rotary Action Group, a lot of syllables in there. Operation Pollination addresses the importance of pollinator habitat on public and private lands. So Elaine, what goals do you have in this area? Our goal, our mission, is to restore, preserve, create, sustain, and educate about the impact of natural habitat as it relates to our quality of life. Our goal, through collaboration, outreach to and engagement with other clubs, Rotary districts, actually all service clubs, and most especially individuals and community partners, sponsors and educators, is to ensure a vibrant pollinator habitat and interconnected mosaic of, on public and private land that will stabilize and or increase populations of pollinator species throughout our area. And overall, this is a bitty, pretty big project. How far does it stretch? It, it is a big project. Um, ours is a community-wide initiative with an international intention because the monarch butterfly population has diminished by 90% here in the east and 99% in the west. They have become our canary in a coal mine. When we have restored a vibrant pollinator habitat along the monarch's migratory flight path from Canada to Mexico, I think we'll be able to breathe easy. And why is this such an important mission to your organization? The causes of, thank you for asking that one. Yeah. As the, the causes of this habitat erosion are, not surprisingly, the use of pesticides, detrimental or modern agricultural practices, urban sprawl, deforestation or illegal logging, and climate change. Because climate change has been such a polarizing issue, it is important to recognize that Rotary is an international service organization comprised of all stripes, men and women, young and older, from many nations, faiths and races united by the principles of Rotary, the object of which is to encourage and foster the ideal of service. Rotary has a 100 plus year track record of doing good things in the world. We believe we can have a significant impact on environmental issues and that it is important for Rotary's reputation to be active on this. And we can naturally do our part on May 1st Right, Elaine? We can help out. Absolutely. May 1st from 9 a.m. to noon, what should we bring to Operation Pollination and where should we meet you guys? Okay, you've stumped me on that. Oh, I'm okay. Sorry. So Operation <laughs> Pollination, uh, the Youngstown Rotary is host, they need volunteers. Um, do you have to be in the Rotary to be included in this e this? <laughs> No, absolutely okay. not. We need okay. everybody and everybody can do something. Excellent. Thank you so much, Elaine, for your time. We can all give back in a special way. Thank you. Sending it over to you, Emily. We have a good time ahead of us today. Better temperatures in the 80s.